Hello again, everybody. It's Scott Hudgens with Dodd RV, located in Yorktown, Virginia. Family owned and operated since 1956. Today, we're looking at a brand new, updated 2024 Forest River Rockwood Ultralight 2608 BS. Front kitchen, huge master bedroom in the back, two entry doors. We equipped it with slide toppers, extra max air fans. Uh, let's get started. Take a look. Hey guys, remember watch all the way to the end of the video. I'll show you a clip with the slides in so you can see what you're doing don't have access to and travel. Always remember, give me a quick thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, hit that bell. That'll give you a notification every time I put a new camper on. So be the first one to see new floor plans, options, decors, make sure you hit that bell. Also check down in the description. I have all your specs, holding tank sizes and measurements. And remember, if you're coming out to the lot to see this or any other camper in person, make sure you ask for Scott. All right, stand at the entry door looking in. You see your slide out, kitchen up front. We are looking at the Sedona cabinetry and your stone decor. So your light fabric, light cabinetry. Kind of took over that Newport ash. Side hallway to the bedroom. That's where we'll start master bedroom we've got a queen bed here you do have a king bed option overhead cabinets with your lights a little charging areas there as well roller shades soft touch headboard lighting you've got receptacles charging areas more receptacles fire escape window does open Roller shades there. We equip this with the TV. It's on a swing arm. You've got the nice wardrobe with the hanging storage. Drawers down low. Drawers that pull out and access behind it, accessible from the outside. Look at that frame. Again, well constructed. It's not just a piece of plywood, but you've got aluminum structure. Bed's not going anywhere. Heat ducts here in the floor in the bedroom. And in the living room. Uh, your steps do fold out, but when they're in, that's how much room they take, so not too much. Solar controller gives you an idea of the power coming off of that. Battery, second AC, which is ducted. Bathroom. Two ways to get to the bathroom, plenty of room around the toilet. Heat duct there, AC duct here. You've got a little night light down low underneath. Corner shower with the shower miser. I'm six foot five, my head. Man, you got another one or two inches maybe above me. So six five is good, six six even. Receptacles, countertop space, medicine cabinet. We mentioned that door, nice spot for a trash can. Again, two ways to get to the bathroom. Flush slide out there. Again, TV on a swing arm gives you easy access to those hookups. Your sound bar, your fireplace is electric. It does put out heat. Talked about the heat ducts. You've got a charging pad, cup holders, storage. Uh, in your seat, you've got this pull cord and this Millersburg collection. Pulls out the footrest. Nice, comfortable seating area. In the living room, you got the day and night shades. More lights with the charging area you got shocks to hold the door up for you your dinette in the down position right now that's how you're going to make the bed you've got drawers here so for the bed drop these cushions into the middle 
lot of people talk about these dinettes. Uh, one nice thing, if anyone is sleeping on it, two people maybe even, because the cushions are going horizontal, I guess, you don't have an issue with them falling off the dinette. So they're gonna stay in place this way. Uh, the table in the down position is nice for it to travel. Uh, that's the griddle and the rack for outside, but we'll take a look at the table in the up, ready to eat position. All right, table up and ready to eat. Nice thing about this, you got longer legs. On one side, you can slide this table around. Nice base, you can take it out, no pedestal in your way. Charging area down low, you see those ledges with the Velcro that the table sits on. Pushing this lock here, unlocks it. You can drop it down to make the bed, coffee table, take it outside. Plenty of, op plenty of different options here with the uh, dinette. Your kitchen, the highlight of the camper. Not the countertop, charging areas, good storage. Look at these new drawers, boys and girls. Lots of storage, new hardware. That windshield lets in a lot of light, but then you got the shade here to block it out for you. Overhead storage. Your flush cover is broken into two pieces so you can strain and wash uh, that large stainless steel sink. Extended spray head. Receptacles. Nice towel. Backsplash. Lighting. LED lights, that flush mount cover, acts as a splash guard. Three burner range, uh, the exhaust does exhaust outside. Microwaves at a good height. Refrigerator freezer, 12 volt, a lot deeper than standard. Water filtration, Forest River spatula, and your tire monitoring system. Nice safety feature, monitor the pressure, temperature, already uh, included with the Rockwood. The handle is the full length here on these new fridges. So nice setup there. And if you don't like opening it that way, boom, open it this way. Either side, up oh, freezer this way, refrigerator this way. You ever see anything like that? Nope. While we got the freezer open, product manuals, they give you a nice folder now, organize everything. Doesn't look organized here, but it will come in the little bag, your uh, mount for outside, if you wanna move that TV outside, all your remotes, all your goodies. Dual zone thermostat, your VRV, you can get the app on your phone, control your slide, your awning, check your holding tanks, your lights. All from one convenient area. Not enough storage, we gave you a pantry. Take these shelves out if you don't need it, you got hanging storage. A little shoe cubby hole down low. So a great setup in this front kitchen. We added the max air fan, got the cover on the roof. Your brand new 2024. Forest River Rockwood Ultralight 2608 BS. We'll work our way outside. Take a look out there. All right, moving to the outside. You see your seven pin and chain holder here. Power tongue jack. Two 30 pound LP bottles under the cover. Spot for two batteries. So they give you the dual battery box. It will come with one battery. You've got the rock guard. You've got the controls here for your LED docking lights, that automotive windshield, nice front cap. We did equip this with slide toppers over your slide outs. 2608, it's got a dry weight of 6,934 pounds. Moving down the side, you see frameless windows, Rockwood Ultralight logo there. Looking at the Goodyear Endurance tires, 15 inch, 
your black and gray pull valve. With this being the front kitchen, you do have two gray tanks. So a separate pull valve for that. Storage here under the bed, which is gonna be your largest storage. You got the new slam latch compartment doors. Still got the magnets to hold them up. Spare tire mounted on your bumper. Got a 50 amp service, detachable cord included. Factory installed ladder, we'll take a look at the roof. All right, up on the roof, your two ACs, max air fan cover, solar panel, TV antenna, your skylight, top of those slide out, slide toppers. Prep for backup camera, slide this spare tire over if you wanna use this receiver, which has a 300 pound hitch rating. So not for towing, but good for bike rack, storage bin. You've got your outside shower, hot and cold, controls for your electric stabilizer jacks, fresh water fill. You do have a black tank flush, winterization, your cable satellite, all in one convenient area, and you got a convenience light right beside it. Two entry doors on this Rockwood. Full length power awning that covers both doors. You got a arm in the middle, basically a support arm so you don't get a sag or bend in that tube over time. It's a nice feature there. You do have step above entry steps. that drop down for not only your living area, but for the master bedroom. You've got a rack here, you've got a prep table, and also an outside griddle, which hooks here, which is included. And that is gonna tee off your LP, which is there. Backside of your hot water heater, furnace, exhaust for your range, and you do have two outside speakers. Sorry we're jumping around a little bit, but your uh, TV hookup is here so you can bring the TV outside and that'll hook right to your power and cable. Lippert's got the screen shot screen door, which closes the screen door for you, but you do have a friction hinge on the door, which will stay where you leave it, or you can lock it in place with this. Your other storage area up front, is accessible from the inside there's your power cord there's that prep table your backup cranks there controls here for those front stabilizers and then you got a prep here for a portable solar panel again this is going to trickle charge those batteries your brand new 2024 forest river rockwood ultralight 2608 remember if you're coming out to the lot to see this or any other camper in person, make sure you ask for Scott. All right, with the slides in, as promised, you're not getting to the bathroom from the front door, but that's why you have access to the back door. Full access to the refrigerator, freezer, no problems, but you're going in through the bedroom door and you can get into the bathroom.